Altium Designer 21 brings many improvements to the schematic editor, aimed at visualizing circuits and improving navigation through them in multi-sheet and hierarchical designs. In addition to net coloring for quick tracking on different schematic sheets, you can use a global net highlighting. By holding Alt and clicking on a net, all schematic instances of the net are highlighted, while other objects are dimmed to visibly indicate the signal propagation in the design. These changes also affect the identification of net names. Now logical and physical names of a net are displayed in the properties panel, as well as when you hover over a wire. This is particularly helpful in hierarchical designs, where a net can have a name that is local to a schematic, a logical net name. The physical name of a net is its actual net list assignment, and that is used for connectivity in the PCB. Another feature that has been improved is the schematic editor cross-reference function, which identifies the location of interconnected ports. It now adds positional page references for off-sheet connectors. To add a link to the sheet with the mating connector, use the reports port cross-reference add to project command. To change the display style or location, you need to go to the schematic area of the preferences. Here, for example, you can choose to not display the name, but rather the number of the schematic sheet, the display of which can be enabled in the project options, which significantly improves the readability of the schematic of even the most complex hierarchical projects. Also, improvements have been made to the navigation between the mating parts of the connectors. In Altium Designer 21, the Connectivity Insight feature allows you to instantly view the connection relationships of the entire project. To do this, hold down the Control and Alt buttons and move the mouse cursor over the connection of interest. Selectable items presented in the form of a document tree provide a quick and intuitive way to navigate the project structure.